wanted to show another art journal process video. I'm going to be tracing one of my sketches onto my mixed media book. I made copies of these sketches, the ones that I've done of girls in another sketchbook. I have some carbon paper here. I taped down with some washi tape the copy and I just wanted to show you my process of adding the sketch with tracing paper or carbon paper onto my mixed media page. You can see here how I've added that faint sketch of the copy that I made of my artwork and I just wanted to show you that process like I said before and this will be the base for my art journal page. I often will sketch things freehand but today I just wanted to show you how to add an image to your sketchbook if you want to by tracing it out tracing out one of your sketches so I'm going to go ahead and work on the art journal page I might add some collage or pastel but you'll be able to see how I work on the page and complete it I chose a few colors from my water soluble soft pastels or hard pastels to add color to the face. I wanted to use something along with my watercolors. I'm just kind of making the sketch lines a little darker. I don't mind if they show. And I think I'm just going to kind of use the outline of her nose, not like as detailed. I think I might just use like a flat line. Sometimes I do that. These are some of the watercolor ephemera that I made in another video. To add collage to my art journal pages and different projects. So you can see I'm just changing the drawing a little bit. And I might, instead of using the pastels and drawing them on, I might just pick up some of the color with my brush. So I'll try that. Um, let's see. Hmm. Okay. I'm not sure how much of the video I'll leave in regular time. And how much I'll leave in time lapse. But I wanted you to at least see how I start the page. I might need to put that on something. <laughs> Just in case. Because I don't necessarily want the background that color. Even though it's not, not really a problem. I'm not sure what I'll put in the background. I might put some words in the side like I did last time on my other page. I'm not usually this 
careful when I'm doing my art journal pages on my own. Only when I'm recording. <laughs> Normally I just go for it and whatever happens happens and then I can change it if I want to but when I'm making a video I always feel like I have to do things a certain way. Maybe because I want people to understand what I'm doing. It's been a few days since I started this art journal page. I taped the sketch, the original one that I traced over here, just so I can have an idea of what it looked like before. I also found these butterfly ephemeras in my collage stash. I decided to use them as the background around the, the portrait or the picture of the face. I'll glue down the full color ones and then just leave the outlines for the background. I hope you liked seeing how I add a drawing to my mixed media page and then how I add different art supplies and different media to pull together one of my art journal pages. If you enjoyed this week's video, don't forget to give a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.